Next up, we have Charlie Jacks of the Advantage Sales. During Charlie's session, you can post your questions by using the Q&A button at the bottom of your Zoom window. And Charlie will answer your questions at the end of his session. At Should this I time, I'd like to turn it over to Charlie and Advantage Sales. Hi, everybody. I'm Charlie Jakes. This is Dana Jordan. Hi. Uh, you probably might have recognized us from some of the meetings. Nice to see all your smiling faces today. There's 161 people here. I haven't had this big of an audience since the uh, Cleveland show, right? <laughs> so anyway, um, there, the format is that we're going to show four different videos showing our capabilities, and um, we're going to take questions in between each one. Um, and there's going to be about a two-minute Q&A. And so we'd like to uh, keep it to that because there's not a lot of uh, time. So let's go ahead and show the first video. We're going to introduce X100 grade 100 chain and fittings. Oh.
Okay, so that's X100. I did want to share with everybody that it comes uh, packaged um, so that if you want to sell the bulk components, um, they always have the proof test load uh, sheets inside and so forth. You can get a lot of more information from www.advantagesales.biz, B-I-Z, it's kind of a different one. But um, if you look on there, there's a whole bunch of information. Um, everything we have is tested. Um, every batch that comes in, every size, we have a person here who is a full-time testing person. Um, one of the things that we're very proud of, uh, a guy named Andy Baker, who um, uh, is doing nothing but break testing things to make sure that our tensils are, are up to speed. Uh, every now and again, we do reject stuff, not so much in X100, but other products. Uh, if we have any problems, they do not hit the market. Um, so right now I'd like to invite anybody to offer any questions they might have. Yeah, Charlie, first question is, what kind of actual design factors are you seeing in your brake tests? Uh, it depends on the product, um, but uh, always to specification. In other words, the, um, the chain is four to one and we're seeing everything from, uh, you know, uh, four and a half to five to one is the general standard uh, for the chain fittings. For the master links, it's going as far as, uh, depending on which way you rate them, four to one or five to one, uh, it can go, it goes really high on those. Um, but, and the ductility is something that we're finding to be very, uh, very encouraging as well. Uh, everything seems to stretch out and yeah, elongate very well. Did I answer the question? Yes. And, and, is the elongation something you really look for in your testing or um, is it simply break, breaking strength? No, elongation is a very, very critical. Some, some uh, items elongate a lot more than others. As you could see, the, um, uh, the, the coupling link uh, didn't elongate as much as the, the master link, um, but we do look for uh, elongation uh, on most products. Now, Coupling links are different. We do a lot of comparative testing as well from other brands just to make sure that we're in step of to where things break, how things stretch, uh, what, what kind of uh, improvements we can make to our products. Um, so yeah, um, like our, for instance, our shackles, they'll stretch out 20, 25%. Uh, okay, is the X100 logo on every product in this group? Yes, it is. Uh, raised letters. We've spent a lot of money on um, on tooling, you know, on dies and and uh, and so forth um, to get um, the uh, to the proper markings on there. Uh, next question is concerning the country of origin of the products. Okay, so uh, we make no bones about it. We're an importer, and uh, this product is made in China. Um, and we realize that there are certain markets that that are don't see that as uh, advantageous. Um, and uh, what I found as a person who travels in China almost every year, obviously not this year, that the um, uh, that there you can choose, you know, dirt floors, broken windows, and and stray dogs running around your factory, or you can choose factories that have robotics, clean rooms, and you know, laboratories. Uh, we choose the latter. Uh, that's how we come to market. Uh, there's a lot of ways to come to market as an importer. You can choose to go as cheap as possible and sell as cheap as possible. We like to bring our products on a quality basis. It's a little bit more money most of the time, but uh, you get what you pay for. Okay, we're starting to run short of time on this one. Um, what's next? Um, is that okay? Uh, if, if everybody could just uh, uh, send in their questions and I'll be happy to answer them. Okay, go ahead.
Uh, right now, I'd like to introduce Dana Jordan, if you haven't met her at the shows. Um, we'd like to talk a little bit about our, uh, our, what our size ranges and, and uh, well, how, we, how we run our sew shop and stuff. Okay. Um, as you saw on the video, our Advantage Webbing is our proprietary blend. And our lead times can stretch out on it sometimes because of our in-house sewing, but we do offer stocking programs for some customers where we can do um, privately la um, labeled tags for you. So there's always options as far as that goes. If there's something that you need to get out right away, we do keep in-house um, Advantage sales tag ones also. Yeah. Okay. And um, so it's what's interesting about our, pro our program with the synthetics is that we keep um, also pre-made ones. If you need a price point, we also, as an importer, we bring in a lot of Advantage tagged in China, made in China. We also can make Advantage here. We can also make all USA uh, components sewn here. Uh, we have a lot of different ways to do it. Uh, any questions? There, don't, there doesn't seem to be any questions. Oh, wait, no, we do have one. Um, how many different size flow line restraints are you offering? Um, Four. Are you making those in-house or outsourcing them? We're making those here in-house. Um, and um, they are, we have yellow, red, blue, and orange. Um, those are the only ones we've ever had a demand for. Uh, if there's other sizes, of, which I'm not aware of or, or need, are necessary, we can certainly try to uh, work with our customers on that. It seems to be the only question on, on webbing. Okay, good question.
go right to the next one, okay? Because we're running out of time. Sorry, guys. If you have any questions, just shoot it, shoot it to us. And, you know, I guess uh, we'll hope to hear from you soon.